If you Googled model student, Luce Edgar's picture would come up on the computer. Given Luce's background, you and Peter must have faced quite a few challenges. The language barrier, the culture shock. I mean, you don't pull a kid out of a war zone and have him turn out like Luce without a lot of help. Which is why this is so difficult. Uh, some quick questions for you, Naomi, and your character. Amy, I'm, I'm wondering, did you do any research uh, when it came to, to, like, interracial adoption and that dynamic? Because I know it's very different yeah. when you have um, mixed families and that, what that was like in society. So did you do any research for that? Yeah, it was important to me. I mean, I there's always the best source of information comes from the Internet and mm -hmm. just reading stories. Um, and... Uh, Talking to some people who who have interracial families as well, um, but it was uh, so beautifully laid out in in this story, as complex as it was, and um, and as difficult as it was. Like playing Amy and and Tim had the same experience. It was it was hard at times because we weren't at peace with all of their decision making. Mm -hmm. um, but you know, when you play a character, you don't want to judge them. Mm -hmm. You just want to empathize and make that a truthful story mm -hmm. with all of its complexities. And Amy, you know, you can relate to to a point because she's just trying to protect her son, mm -hmm. and she, no matter what, she doesn't want a mark on his you know, history at all, and just, like, just deliver, 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 and we did all the therapy, everything's fine, we can just keep moving forward. Mm -hmm. It turns out that that's not hugely self-aware. That's right. actually, you know, massive blind spots, and um, so it was a challenge for her when this situation comes up, and she keeps trying to soldier on through and rise above it, um, and this kid probably only just needed people to look at him and mm -hmm. say, you know, who are you? What do you need? How do I understand you better? What do you want? What, mm -hmm. How can I facilitate that? Rather than assuming that they know better and this is who you are and this is who you should become. Mm -hmm. Your character, Harriet, um, what drew you to the role? Because I would look at the script and be like, wow. You know, she has, uh, she's dealing with her sister Rosemary, mm -hmm. and she's also dealing with being framed and not being believed, mm -hmm. which is something uh, I know a lot of people, especially now, are talking about how black women are often shouldering this big burden, and mm -hmm. often when they speak out, they're not believed. Um, mm -hmm. So what is it that drew you to the role, even though it's like a, you know, it's a very heavy, heavy burden for the character? All of those things that you said, mm -hmm. I... Uh, I love the idea of playing a complex character like that, who, like Amy, didn't have all the answers, but she was certainly trying. Um, and while I didn't believe uh, in, or, or not, while I don't subscribe to her ideology in the one king, I believe that everyone should be king, um, uh, you know, especially with academics mm -hmm. uh, and the academic potential, um, I, I thought it would be very interesting to play someone who, uh, had very different uh, views than I had, mm -hmm. um, and also, uh, you know, I think, I think the women um, in the film represent what we all as women face, especially right. the women of color. Mm -hmm. And it's a it's a great conversation starter, isn't it, to say, oh, yeah. you know, as a as a mom, you there are, are decisions that she had to make. As a teacher, a black woman, mm -hmm. and who's caring for a mentally ill sister, there are decisions that she has to make, and there are repercussions for those decisions on all sides. Right. So it's a wonderful conversation starter, and I'm, I'm glad that we get to be a part of that conversation. He wrote a paper in which he argued that violence was a necessary cleansing force. You, you teach this? I don't. So what? It's just something's going on, and I want to be in front of it. She thinks I'm a poster boy, black kid who overcame his tragic past. You really don't like her, do you? OK, what a bad responsibility to tell the truth.